Hi and welcome to a new weekly vlog. Um, this week I'm going to have to film it all on my phone I'm afraid because my camera is not working as you will have seen at the end of last week's vlog so it's really annoying. I've not worked out yet where I'm going to take it or anything. I think I've got a guarantee on it so I just need to look into it. I can't even really remember where I bought it from now but um, I will find out and discover what I need to do to get it fixed. Um, I'm doing quite a bit of travelling tomorrow, I've got meetings in Berkshire and in London. So I'm flying at like 20 past 6 tomorrow morning and I don't get home until like half 8 at night. So yeah, tonight is going to be very quiet. I'm going to make dinner, get a shower, get into bed, hopefully around half 7, 8ish, we'll see. I always like say that whenever I'm doing travelling and then I end up getting into bed at like 9, 10 o'clock. I'm just feeling so tired the next again day but we're trying not to do that. Um, I've got like all my transport and stuff booked for tomorrow. I do need to double check where my second meeting is because it's a place I've not been before and um, I'm not, I kind of, I like to like look at things on Street View so that I sort of know what I'm looking out for. Even though I'm getting a taxi there once I get into London, I still kind of want to know what I'm looking out for just in case the taxi driver's like, I've never heard of this place before, don't know where I'm going. Morning, so it is Wednesday today. Sorry, I was putting shoes on. I didn't really film anything yesterday. I was traveling the whole day and I had in my head that I was gonna film like little clips kind of as I was going along, but um, I think I filmed one bit, which I will insert now, which is riveting. Um, but yeah, it was just a really, really long day. I got the flight at 6.20. And then I, over the course of the, where the hell is it? Sorry, I'm just looking for my lyrics for choir tonight, which are not here. Great. Um, oh, I know, it'll be in my other handbag. Um, yeah, so over the course of the day, I got five trains, five taxis, two flights, and one car journey. So it was a very long day. I left, I got up at 4 a.m. and there they are. Um, so I got up at 4am and got back, got back to the house at just after 9 o'clock, so very long day. I'm going in for 10 today because I was just too tired to like get up for my usual time, stand in front of the window. Um, but then tonight's the night I've got choir anyway, so I normally work till like quarter to seven, so it doesn't really matter. I've got flexible hours, so um, yeah. It doesn't matter that I'm going in for 10 basically. It was a very, very long day. Um, meetings went well though, and um, my journeys were incident free. Um, I was like, the, the flight there in the morning was really good. It was easy jet, but I think it was like a brand new plane because the seats and everything felt brand new. There was like a lot more space than normal, I think, um, like in kind of legroom wise. And I had a window seat and I just basically slept the entire way or kind of half slept the entire way. And it was a really, really smooth flight. Like I barely noticed I was in the air. But then coming home, it was a packed BA flight. I was in the middle of two guys who were like reading big papers and the seats were so uncomfortable. Like I tried like, like kind of leaning back just so I could put my headphones in and have a wee snooze. But um, yeah, the back felt like there was no padding in it whatsoever. It was just so uncomfortable. We'd have thought that like, BA would have had a better quality flight, but um, no, I was actually much more impressed by the EasyJet flight. So there you go. Though I didn't get a free drink on EasyJet, but um, but I would have rather had a comfy seat than a can of Pepsi Max and a packet of crisps. I also didn't really get a proper dinner yesterday. Like I, when I arrived in London, I had like an hour and a bit for before my first train. So I went to Costa and got a granola bar and a peppermint tea. And then I was like traveling, had my meeting, traveling, had another meeting, traveling back to the airport. And I got to the airport at five past six and they were calling our, or they were gonna announce our gate at 25 past. So I didn't really have time to, I was like planning on maybe going to Yo Sushi or something, but I didn't have time to do that. So I went to eat, bought a wrap and some crisps and ate that, which wasn't that exciting. I mean, the wrap was quite nice. It's like a fajita wrap. Um, yeah, and then it was like just on the plane on the way home. So I didn't eat very much yesterday. I already feel pretty hungry this morning. Um, sorry, I know it's probably annoying. I feel like there's a hair in my face somewhere. There we go. Um, so when I get to work today, I'm going to go to um, Cafe Nero, get a drink and maybe a muffin or something. Just home from choir. It's about half ten or coming up for half ten. And yeah, I just feel incredibly tired. 
definitely going to get straight into bed once I've finished doing this. Um, I did film like a couple of bits at choir tonight, not like my phone was kind of sitting on the chair so there's nothing to, for you to see but I will insert some like clips of the songs that we're rehearsing just now. Oh, happy day. So yeah, that's some of the songs that we're doing at the moment. <laughs> like, my voice is really croaky now. Um, obviously, I've been singing too hard. Yeah, it was actually really quiet tonight. Like, there was only about, like, 12 of us. And I think it sounded quite good, so it'll be even better when we've got, like, a full group of people. Because I think there's about, like, 30 in total um, in the full choir. And I hope it's about that much that are doing the shows. Um, although apparently we're going to be, like, mic'd up, so it won't... Even if there's like a smaller group of us, it'll be fine. And we've got like some sort of backing track as well. Apart from that, work was quite good today. I was just kind of catching up because I was off or I was out of the office on Tuesday. This afternoon, we basically had like every type of cake that you can get from M&S we had in our office. Um, it was kind of because like there'd been a couple of birthdays, there we'd won some big accounts and we launched our new website today. Um, so it was kind of like a wee celebratory thing, but literally like, you know how you get all those like boxes, like those like tubs of like flapjacks and things? We had every type of them. We had like five different types of mini cupcakes. We had French fancies, um, bakewell tarts, apple tarts, and like a bunch of fruit as well. It was insane. Like the meeting room table was just covered in cakes and there's still probably about 75% of it left. So that we're gonna be eating cakes and stuff for the next couple of days. Yeah, I was gonna have a shower when I got in tonight because as you can probably tell, my hair is an absolute disgrace, but um, I'm just too tired, too tired. So I will just get up early tomorrow and have a shower before I go to work. Just now I'm gonna put pajamas on, potentially Blair will want to watch Better Call Saul, so we might watch that or might just get into bed. Morning, it's Friday. Um, I don't really have much else to say other than it's Friday. And um, my phone battery is about to die, so can't really say much else. Okay, it's Saturday morning. I'm just about to clean the bathroom because it hasn't been done in ages and Blair's having a little party tonight, so kind of need to make sure that it's tidy, so. This is the before with all the junk set up. I've pulled out the little drawers into the hall for now because I want to hoover as well. Right, it's clean now, just needs the floor done, which Blair will do when he gets back from getting his hair cut. Right, next task. Okay, I now need to sort through my birthday present bag, put my weekend away bag away, um, and try and, yeah, tidy up here a little bit. Okay, so it's a bit later now. I've done all my chores, I've had a shower, I've watched the Pretty Little Liars finale, which was ridiculous, by the way. If you have watched it already, you will understand <laughs> what I'm talking about. Like, where, where does A get these, like, really realistic masks? I don't think I've said what I'm doing tonight. Um, I mentioned that Blair's having some friends round to the flat. I am going around to my friend Kirsty's. We're having, like, a little girl's night in. Very casual, which is why I'm in comfy clothes. Got my hair up in a little bun. Um, I'm taking some, like, drinks round with me. We're going to have cocktails and order Chinese and just have a catch-up. It would be nice to just have a good girly catch-up. Um... While earlier today as well, my sister came round. She lives in Manchester, but she was up very briefly today. Um, so she popped in to drop off my birthday present, which I'll insert a clip of. She knitted me a cuddly owl, which reminds me of Hugsy from Friends. Um, it's very cute and it's sitting in our living room just now. We went to M&S and bought like some snacks and stuff, part, some for Blair's little party and some for me to take to Kirsty's. And yeah, like I said, it's been watching watching stuff on my laptop. Um, I was looking at my blog 
and YouTube Google Analytics because I'm sad uh, and discovered that I've had some visits from Guru Gossiper this week. I think that means I've like officially made it as a blogger and YouTuber. Um, <laughs> Joking, obviously. Um, I can't. I don't know where it's come from. Like, there's doesn't tell you exactly what pages or anything it's come from. So I don't know. Might be something nice. Might be something horrible. Who knows? Um. Anyway, I need to go and get a bus now. It's Kirsty's. Um. I need to go and pack up all the stuff that I bought. I'll maybe show you a clip of that before I leave. Um, and yeah, hopefully I will film some bits when I'm there. If anything, there will at least be some clips of Fitz the cat to entertain you. Our Chinese has arrived. Oh, oh, oh. Got my little lap tray. I'm <laughs> so sorry I can't be with you in person tonight. Yeah, to the tune of 100,000 euros of underwater serving clown. Get off the vlog stage. Hey, it's Sunday. It's quite late on the afternoon now. I didn't get out of bed until half twelve, so yeah, it's been quite like a short day. Um, last night I was at Kirsty's and I had a really nice time. We watched basically four and a half hours worth of RuPaul's Drag Race. I've never seen it before, and she's now got me hooked. So we watched the series four finale and then like the first five, four or five episodes of series five. So that was good. We ordered a Chinese, um, had a good chat, made various rum cocktails. So yeah, very chilled out, just sitting on the sofa. Eating food, having drinks, watching TV, um, watching the cat. Uh, I got back here at like 1am um, and Blair's little boys night party was still in full swing. Luckily I didn't have to clean up any party aftermath because the two guys that stayed over like tidied up the living room in the morning which is very nice. Um, and Blair's been extremely hungover today. I've never really seen him like properly drunk but he was pretty drunk so he's been feeling not very nice today so I took a walk to the shops earlier um, bought some food and came back had some lunch we've just been watching the latest episode of 13 which is like a drama that's on BBC 3 um, which I'm really enjoying at the moment but I'm going to edit this vlog and then if I've got time I might watch a Drag Race episode and then I'll start dinner and um, I think I'm going to make steak pie tonight which will be nice and yeah then it's just usual like Sunday night routine of having a shower, maybe doing a face mask and um, get ready for a week of work. Ah, there's like sun over there blinding me. Thank you very much for watching. This is crazy. This is a good angle. Uh, thank you for watching. See you next week. Goodbye.